Imagine a city where every building is protected by unique locks and keys. For years, these locks have kept everything safe, from personal documents to bank vaults. But now, a new locksmith is in town. Armed with tools so advanced, they can pick any lock in seconds. This locksmith is the quantum computer. As we approach this quantum era, our traditional locks, our current cryptographic methods, are at risk of becoming obsolete. For years, cryptographic methods like RSA and elliptic curve cryptography have been the gold standard in securing everything from online banking to mobile communications. These methods rely on mathematical problems that are impossible for classical computers to solve. Quantum computers operate on a completely different level. They leverage the principles of quantum mechanics to process information in ways classical computers can't. This capability poses a serious threat for cryptography. A sufficiently powerful quantum computer could effortlessly break the cryptographic methods we rely on today. The truth is, no one knows exactly if and when a quantum computer will actually have the capability to break today's cryptography. But for cryptographers, that uncertainty doesn't change the urgency. We must address this threat now for two key reasons. The first reason is that some of the data exchanged today, such as personal, financial or military information, will remain sensitive for decades. Attackers can already intercept and record encrypted communications. Even if they can't decrypt this data now, they could save it and wait for the day that a quantum computer can crack it. This is known as the Harvest Now, Decrypt Later strategy. The second reason is that essential tools for authenticating documents, websites and transactions, such as digital signatures and certificates, could lose their reliability once quantum computers reach maturity. While this may still be years away, migrating to quantum-resistant alternatives is a complex and time-consuming process. It's important to begin this transition now so it can be completed before the quantum threats materialize. When cryptographers realized that quantum computers could efficiently solve problems like integer factorization, which underpins much of our modern cryptography, they began exploring alternative mathematical problems. Fortunately, quantum computers are not supercomputers capable of speeding up everything. Some problems remain difficult even for them. Cryptographers are now developing new algorithms based on these problems, a field known as post-quantum cryptography. At Idemia Secure Transactions, we have spent nearly a decade advancing research and development in post-quantum cryptography with a strong focus on implementing it in smart cards and secure elements. We continuously optimize our software to ensure top performances despite the complexity of this new cryptography. By doing so, we build the foundations of tomorrow's security and we are ready to support the migration to post-quantum solutions.